Defending Drunk Drivers. As part of our Project Drive Sober campaign, we sat down with an OWI defense attorney with a unique perspective on curbing drunk driving. Shannon Sims explains how he thinks Wisconsin can change for the better. Ex-firefighter Josh Larson killed two people in a drunk driving crash on opening day in 2016. We spoke with his attorney, Julius Kim. He shares his views on representing a number of OWI offenders and how Wisconsin can prevent further tragedies. A partner at a self-described top defense firm, Julius Kim, tells us more than half of his cases are OWI related. While first offenses make up the majority, Kim represents drunk drivers facing their eighth, ninth, and even tenth convictions. I always feel a little bit of sadness when that happens because, you know, our goal in when working with clients is to try and avoid them getting in trouble again in the future. Kim says addiction and a culture of binge drinking keeps repeat offenders coming into his office. Sometimes life happens is what happens. And I think that um, people um, get uh, complacent. They forget the process, the punishment that they, that they receive. And so they let their guard down. It's a place seven-time convicted drunk driver Todd Hallfelder found himself before he spent three years behind bars. He says he had no desire to seek help or change, even as the OWI convictions racked up. I don't feel that I wanted to at the time. Over all those years, I, I just stuck with that party boy mentality probably a little longer than I should have. Kim believes one way to fight the problem is to shame those who choose to drive drunk. He cites years of anti-smoking ad campaigns and how it's changed the way we look at smokers today. We need to reward responsible behavior and encourage responsible behavior, but we also need to stigmatize people's failure to plan or to help others. Hallfelder agrees, adding it has to be a message that is also on offenders' minds. It really needs to be drilled into our heads, I'm going to say, that what we did, what we did was, you know, what was wrong, what was wrong about it. But while drinkers continue to get behind the wheel, Kim and his firm will continue to take OWI cases. Our job is to, isn't necessarily to get people off and to, and to make sure people walk away scot-free. Most of the time, our job is to make sure that whatever disposition occurs in the case is a fair disposition so that people aren't just swept up in, in a wave of anger and outrage by the community. Kim helped negotiate a plea deal for Joshua Larson in the fatal opening day crash. Prosecutors wanted eight years sentence for the former firefighter. A judge increased that sentence to 10. Thank you, Shannon. Our commitment to end drunk driving Wisconsin is why we started Project Drive Sober. You can see all our stories, check out resources and submit a story idea. Just go to TMJ4.com slash drive sober.